Hey guys, Stankum here. I'm back with part 10 of Kerbal Space Program, my hard mode campaign. Um, I'm bringing back this ship, which is worth $15,000 to me. Um, it has some temperature data from some waypoint nearby. Um, and what's cool about it, I did a uh, unmanned spaceship. First time I've really done this successfully, so I'm, I'm kind of happy about that. Um, let's just get this thing down into the water, recover it, and I will be happy. Uh, as I was saying in, in a couple videos ago, I'm, I'm in desperate need of money, um, because I, I can't get a big enough launch pad to launch a bigger ship, and I don't have a big enough ship to get enough money to, it's a mess. So, I'm just kind of doing these small missions, learning as I go and uh, hopefully recover my game here because I'm doing pretty bad right now <clears throat> learning a lot of stuff though so that's good cool recovered almost all the money to 98,000 and I did finish that mission right? yes I did Okay. Ooh. Now that's a nice, uh, that's a nice payout, but I have to be 230,000 meter orbit. That's pretty high. I don't think I could do that. Yeah, I can't really do any of these. I'm going to end the day here and hope I get some bear missions the next day. I hate these missions. Altitude 3,000 to 9,000 meters. Speed 360 to 490. <coughs> <clears throat> Alright, here's an easy one. Test heat shield, splash down. Um that's so easy it's almost funny for 8500 8, actually no that's like 11,000 nice I'm taking it easy money so I'm going to use the same ship uh, all I'm going to do is throw on a uh, a heat shield here I'll actually I'll just put it in the um I'll just put it in the bay here. That'll be even better. There we go. I think that's good, right? Sure. Oh, you know what? I'll put it up there. Stays nice and centered, easy to get to. Make sure that's the right one. Um, 0.65, yep, that's it. Alright, and I don't need all these... Uh, I don't need all these things. It's way overkill. There we go. Um, I guess I'll leave the batteries on there. I can just recover them. It's fine. Okay, uh, lunch, right? Why do I feel like something's wrong? I don't know. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Alright. And this is splashed down, yeah.
No, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't. Heck. Oh, come on. Ridiculous. You know, I almost just want to let this crash. Just because I'm so mad right now. Just, uh, yeah. Really, you couldn't just fly straight for a little bit for me. You couldn't do that. It's not that much to ask. Good landing, good. <coughs> Next. What kind of signs do I have? Thirty six. Not enough. Uh, let me throw one of those science juniors on here, and I'll try to, um, try to get some more science. I feel like that could be helpful right now. Because, um, they have the little reaction wheels, and I'm thinking one of those, uh, could help me stabilize my ships, my unmanned ships anyways. I don't know if that's true, I don't know if I'm going crazy, but, um, that's what I'm hoping. Okay, this looks okay. Let's do it. And I can take, I think I get, I'll be able to take these scientific readings at a bunch of different spots here. So observe, mineral, materials bay. Alright, let's transport, transmit that. Comms device in this vessel cannot transmit, why? Uh, don't be stupid. Review data. Transmit. Transmit data. Why can't you transmit? Review data. Transmit data. Ah, uh, I thought maybe opening this would do it for me, but... It must not be able to... Ah, uh, that's so annoying. Okay, well, I'm not going to take the four science. I'm going to try to get some up in the air. I think that'll give me uh, that'll give me more science. Okay, let us launch. Here we go. I'm going to keep it straight for a little bit longer. I put two two uh, two of these medium fuel tanks on here, so that I have a little bit longer. Uh, all right, let's try to turn just a little bit. All we need to do is get into the water. I don't need to do anything fancy. I don't really care if it goes haywire now. There we go. Let's give it just a little more nudge. The ship is not wanting to behave at all. Alright, observe materials bay. Let's get um, 10.5. There we go. I like that. <clears throat> Good. All we need to do here is splash down and test the um, the uh, heat shield in there. That's our mission right now. So just speed this up a little. I'll get to like 25. Pop these bad boys out. Sweet. Look at this, going in head first. I like it. Okay. 
gonna slow down. Let's run test. And that's good. Get our 10 science. I'm hoping that's 45. Let's see. 48, good. Awesome. <clears throat> We're up to 109,000 now. It's very good. No, I need, um, I want to go to the, uh, yep, research and development. Where is my flight control? All right, the inline reaction wheel system uses a series of spinning discs that are going very fast to generate the torque necessary to control spacecraft without wasting any propellant. Okay. Um... This winglet has uh, control surfaces on it, I guess. So, yeah, so that will probably help me a lot. I'm all about the unmanned vehicles now. All right, did I put a, I could have sworn I put an antenna in here. Either I did, and it just can't communicate since it's inside the thing or I didn't put an antenna at all. No, I didn't put an antenna. I not man, I know I did. All right. Let's see communication put mm, We don't need to. I'll just put one. I hope that doesn't interfere with drag or something. <clears throat> what else did I just got? Oh yeah, 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 I got the uh, the reaction wheels, so I will put one of them bad boys on. Let's remove this heat shield. That was just for test. Don't need that. Um. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Alright, inline reaction wheel. That's what I want. Um, Look at that thing of beauty. There's my antenna sticking out. My batteries. I'm going to replace these winglets with the new ones that have control surfaces. And we'll try to find another close range mission. I want to actually see how this thing flies now. Um, I'm hoping it's good. We'll give three engines. I don't know where I'm going yet, but uh, I assume we'll need three. We'll see. All right, leave back to mission control. Let's see. What do we got? What do we got? Have Rocco Max brandy coupler, and we just need to be high up. And what do we get? We get fifteen thousand. Okay, I'll do it. 
Might have to uh, do a little trickery with the ship here, but it shouldn't be too bad. Um, decoupler, we're testing that, and I think we have a, um, uh, we don't have the, the adapter, do we? Son of a gun. This thing will probably fly like garbage. I don't even know if I'll be able to get up to the height with this. <sighs> okay. Let's see what happens. I want to take some science readings too with the science junior. Observe materials bay. Can we transmit this time? What? No comms. There is a comms. Yeah, I see it right there. I see it. Darn it. as bad as I expected to. Giant hula hoop on it. So we got these wings now. So I'm hoping if I have any issues these wings can kind of uh, correct for them. Now all we need to do is get up high. We don't need to do anything fancy at all. And I got this, uh, right, let's see, how high are we? We need to get to 35,000. I don't want to go any higher than that, um, because we might burn up on our way down. So I'm just going to go high enough to get there, and then I'm cutting the engines right there. science. I'll take that for sure. Can I do a temperature reading by chance? I highly doubt it. It's worth a shot though. Sort of. Nope. Okay, so there's 15,000. I'm happy with that. now. Yep. Okay, and they'll open up when they're at the correct height and speed.
learning a lot about this game doing these little missions like this which is great thud Fourteen thousand. So I hate these one with multiple uh, waypoints. I, I'm just not good enough, and I don't have enough parts to really do that. Uh, this person wants to orbit around the planet. She's gonna give me like seventeen thousand. <clears throat> could do it, but um, I just don't, I don't think it's a good idea. That's way too specific, I don't want to do that. This Holland flight, so I need to go 1610 to 1990 at that altitude, that's going to be way too hard way way too hard with a 2.5 meter shield I don't think so all right I'm going to advance a day Let's see if I get any better missions all right let's see test gear splashdown Can I just decline and... Yeah, I'm not going to do that. Not going to happen. Uh, explore the moon is three. Why? Hmm. I didn't explore the moon to begin with. Why is it giving me this crazy mission now? I mean, I could, tr I could upgrade the landing pad, and I could probably do this. And I would get all my money back, plus some, from up upgrading the landing pad. This one I'll get 26,000, just for going in an escape trajectory. might be worth it to uh, upgrade the landing pad but first let me do this splash down test the small landing gear easy enough if I want to pay for that landing pad I should probably save up more right put that there Small landing gear. It's ridiculous. All right, they are started retracted. Cool with that. Ooh, they have lights. Heck yes. Alright. So all I need to do is splash down and test these suckers. Let's just go up a little bit and I will turn. And splash down. Oh, don't go crazy, don't go crazy, just turn. Just turn. So wobbly. That is perfect. Oh, this. 
this ship right here is great. It flies like junk, but it's great still. It's making me all sorts of money. Let's see what kind of money we get for this. 2.3. No. I'm going to wait till we're in the ocean here and run it. Let's retract one of these just in case we need to be extended for some reason. I don't think we do. Why did that happen? Because I hit it on fast speed? Really? Oh my gosh, dude. Game. Game, I just don't get you sometimes. Nah. Oh. All these pieces are here. I, I think I'll have to make my money back, but I have to recover each one of these individually. Is there a quick way to do this? Please tell me there is. Can't I just right click it and recover? Oh, here we go. Recover. Can I shift? No, I can't. Recover, recover. All my pieces. Good. Got my money back. Okay, here's the ship with that. Uh, I'll take off one of the fuel tanks. Maybe it was too heavy coming down. That's what I'm assuming. <coughs> Actually, move this up to like the top. And that way, it comes down butt first instead of head first. All right, try that again. Launch, launch, launch. Let's turn. Oh, I love these fins. Look at those things. This is some like ballistic missile here. Blow something up with this. <clears throat> All right, I'm not gonna leave this on speed for when I touch the water, because I have to think that that's what's that's what caused that to explode. I mean, it is coming down kind of fast, though. 8.3. These landing gears must be pretty heavy. Or something. I don't know. Oh, yeah. That's pretty good. So, run test. All's good. Recover vehicle. I didn't run the... I didn't run the Science Junior thing, which I wanted to do. It's okay. screwing stuff up like that. <clears throat> Test Juno engine at the uh, at the launch site. All right, easy as can be. Save that one. There. Where's the